Hey, my friends, uh, let's just quickly complete question uh, 11a, part 2 and 3. Now, here in part 2, they're asking us to state one geometric relationship between the line segment BA and BC. Now, quickly, um, that's pretty easy. Here, I let me just pull down our answer here. Here it states the line segment AB and BC are parallel. So that's a geometric re uh, reason or relationship rather that B to A um, shares with B to C. And quickly, I could show you what I'm speaking about. Um, it's, it's pretty easy. It's mind boggling. Um, in regards to parallel, two lines, two or more lines are parallel. Okay. If they are the same distance apart from each other or if they merge as one line. Now notice the line BC would be from B straight through that point and I would stop at C. Okay, so that's a line segment BC. And if you should note carefully, my friends, the line BA, and let's just grab a nice color here. Let's use a green. The line B to A would start at the point B and it would stop at the point A. So there we would have it in terms of those two lines that they're asking us about. And if you should look carefully, BA sits exactly on BC. All right. So that's what we are speaking about. All right. So pretty much that's it. Uh, in part three, they are, they're asking us now to draw a diagram to show the real, to show the relative position of A, B, and C, the three points. Well, as you would have known, we had already sketched the diagram. Now, one quick piece of uh, information that I would like to share with you before I leave is that whenever whenever um, they ask you to sketch, now in the exam you wouldn't do this, and I'm just underlining that word sketch, you wouldn't draw this on a graph leaf, you would just simply use your rule and um, pencil to draw it on a plain sheet, okay, because they ask for a sketch, so you wouldn't draw it officially on a graph leaf, you just draw your Cartesian plane, your x-axis and your y-axis and you just basically put in the three points. So let me show you what your sketch would look like in essence. So what I'm going to do, I'm just simply going to be getting rid of to answer part three. Just get rid of these lines. Oops, sorry about that. So here we go, my friends. Uh, we would just simply get rid of uh, these lines that we have drawn. So this is what your sketch would should look like. OK, so there we go. Um, that that that's what you draw for your sketch where you show the relative points of A, B and C. OK, hope that this was useful. See you in the next video. Bye bye.